Hi, Nathan Seidel, founder of SparkFun Electronics, here again today to give you an update on an exciting new product called the GNSS Disciplined Oscillator. This one's got a special place in my heart because it's going to push my own technical skills today. So this clock is so accurate, I'm going to have to read something here from a company called Fugro Atomicron just to get across what we're talking about. Fugro Atomicron provides extreme frequency stability as well as extreme accurate time references with levels that surpass high caliber industrial standard cesium clocks approaching hydrogen maser performance. This thing sitting in front of you is more accurate than a cesium clock approaching a maser. A maser, something the size of a small mini fridge contained in this small orange contraption. How do we do that? Let's talk about it today. So let's start with um, the upside. This is the GNSS Discipline Oscillator with a time reference when everything is up and running better than a one nanosecond accuracy. That's the upside. Now the downside, the price tag on this device is about $2,500. However, there's a $1,000 monthly access fee to the Fugro Atomicron network. Now, to take a step back, how does GNSS work? Let's talk about how any GNSS receiver is uh, synchronized, has its own internal clock synchronized to the atomic clocks in the GNSS satellites above us, right? That, that coupling is tightly done, uh, gets you down to about 20 nanoseconds. So any low cost GNSS receiver has a pretty accurate time base of 20 nanoseconds. But how do we get it even more accurate than that? Inside the GNSS disciplined oscillator is a, a module from Septen Trio, the Mosaic T. The Mosaic T is uh, specially designed to handle high precision timing applications. This one off the shelf will get you down to about five nanoseconds. We have coupled that with a really accurate Psi Times part. The Psi Times T5358 super temperature controlled crystal oscillator allows us to take the corrections from the Mosaic T and slightly nudge the bias on that clock until we can get down into that five nanosecond or the better than one nanosecond timing that you can get from the Fugro Atomicron network. As part of the output information, we can see the bias of the internal clock and how close the clock signal is to the Atomicron network and therefore UTC. We're talking about fractions of a nanosecond off of world time. Now, Included on this board, the Mosaic T, the side times part for really accurate timing, we have the ESP32, which allows us to track the bias and trim that timing down to uh, a 10 megahertz output. So how accurate is this 10 megahertz clock? It's 10 with 10 zeros. So 10.00000000000 megahertz. It's a really, really accurate clock. That Psi Times temperature controlled oscillator is really unique in that it allows us a holdover period. So if signal is disrupted or if say we go underground and out of range, uh, it will hold over the signal, continue that really accurate 10 megahertz signal for up to about 30 minutes. That is the value of a temperature controlled oscillator. In addition to the Mosaic T, the SP32, and the Psi Times part, we also include uh, power over Ethernet and some onboard voltage regulation. This is really meant to be a hardened, deployable network device so that whether in your lab or other infrastructure, you can have a, an accurate time base for whatever project you're working on. So on the back side of the GNSS Disciplined Oscillator, we've got a variety of SMA connectors, some screw terminals, and a PoE Ethernet jack. Uh, the main source is connected up to our GNSS antenna up on the roof, included in the kit, as well as a uh, GPS pulse per second, um, that 10 megahertz output, and then an event input. So let's say that you're trying to triangulate or coordinate uh, an event, you can input events into the system and have an accuracy of about 20 nanoseconds on each one of those events. On the front side, we've got our uh, configuration ports, our micro SD logging, and a nice big display to show us our, our current longitude and latitude. But again, this is not a positioning device. Uh, it is a timing device. And as part of the display, you can actively see the bias on your signal. Uh, currently, we're seeing about um, 99 picoseconds. And you'll see that vary and, and raise up into the hundreds of picoseconds and sort of uh, positive and negative bouncing around always better than one nanosecond. The Fugro Atomicron service is um, a very powerful service that will allow you to get that really accurate timing, but it also provides something called authentication. So whether you're doing positioning or timing, you really want to know that the signals that you're getting are not being spoofed, are not being jammed. And that's where authentication comes into play by coordinating or can combining those authentication signals with the GNSS signals, we can verify that they are true and that everything is as it should be. That authentication service is extremely valuable and part of the $1,000 a month price tag. 
So we realized this product is interesting in the, for spark fun. It is uh, an exciting product, but not one for our normal core. Uh, the type of folks that get really excited are the, the clock nuts, the timing folks. Uh, when you start talking about Allen deviations and better than one nanosecond, it starts to get really exciting. So this product is really designed for folks that need a, a piece of lab kit that gives them a time base where they can synchronize two devices. The Fugro Atomicron coverage is global. It's, it's redundant, it is all over the place. So if you take two of our devices or five of our devices and deploy them across the world, all of those will have the same clock down to less than one nanosecond. So if you're doing some sort of scientific experiment or uh, robotics or automation where you are losing uh, GNSS signals, say going underground, you can synchronize your clocks before going out of range. Now, as part of the GNSS Disciplined Oscillator product, you get all the antenna, the cables, the micro SD card, power adapters, everything you need to deploy this in your own infrastructure. High precision timing is a new market for SparkFun to be entering, and it really has us pretty excited. So if you are considering uh, uh, your next sort of high precision timing product, consider the SparkFun GNSS Disciplined Oscillator. Should I just keep talking or should I pull this out and should I point it at stuff? Shut it one more time. Oh, the whole yeah. thing? Yeah, the whole thing. The whole, whole thing. <laughs> I think I've covered everything. <laughs> now, how you, how, how'd that sound?